UK. This is Sky News. Cloning of human embryos comes a step closer today. A report by government scientists will call for the technique to be used for research purposes, but not for copying actual human beings. A minibus and a lorry have crashed in freezing fog in Leicestershire. Five members of a football club have died and a dozen are injured. They're trying to tighten up vetting procedures for the new Deal Jobs program because known sex offenders have ended up working with children. The loopholes are described as a serious flaw and will be closed in the new year. And scientists in Cambridge have pioneered a new test which could revolutionise the diagnosis of cervical cancer. It involves marking cancerous cells with a dye so that they stand out. Virgin Sports, brought to you by today's Times at 30p. Graham Thorpe's been sent home from England's Tour Down Under as his teammates drew their match with Victoria. It's the second tour in a row he's had to pull out of because of his back problem. He won't be replaced, replaced immediately because the tourists are still at full strength number-wise. Thorpe had hoped it had cleared up. I came out here and my mind fully fit. The first six weeks went well, but it flared up again yesterday. A little bit stiff and obviously struggled to bat in the afternoon. Nottingham Forest boss Dave Bassett called his players fairies as they lost 3-2 at Sheffield Wednesday. He also accused them of treating the first half as if it was an exhibition game and later today David Batty finally re-signs for Leeds and in the UEFA Cup tonight Liverpool hosts Celtic Vigo while Rangers are at Parma Virgin Sport with today's times under the skin of sports the weather starting drizzly getting brighter by lunchtime with highs of 12 Virgin News I'm Varianne Corrigal